Barcelona versus Real Madrid. Why El Clasico is bigger than ever. The curtain will be raised on the next chapter of El Clasico this weekend when Barcelona welcome Real Madrid into camp now. It's a chapter that promises to introduce us to the biggest Clasico ever. Two new managers are set to be thrown into the cauldron following a summer of change at both clubs. Carlo Ancelotti replaced Jose Mourinho, whose antics were growing tiresome, at Madrid, and Gerardo Martino took over at Portito de la Nova on the Catalan coast. And the new man could prove just the lick of paint to make the excitement levels soar. Ancelotti is a manager of great pedigree, having won league titles in Italy, England and France. While Martino arrived from Argentina with a great reputation and the offer of outside influence at Barcelona, it's clear the Italian is trying to offer a more stylistic approach in the Spanish capital and, coupled with Barcelona's defensive frailties, it could lead to a high-scoring Plexico. Speaking in the slash RX Google Plus Hangout on Thursday, Gillen Balladway went as far as predicting a 3-2-3 draw, and game sports K. Murray leaned toward the theory of plenty of goals too. Throw in the involvement of Clasico veterans Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo and the introduction of two new characters in Neymar and Gareth Bale, and the stage is set for a phenomenal sporting occasion. But it's not just what's going on at both clubs that has elevated the level of the Clasico to such an extreme high, but the globalization of football too. The internet, specifically online streaming and social media, has enabled the popularity of domestic leagues to soar in countries they were previously considered unknown and mysterious. Across every continent people will tune in to witness the latest installment of Los Blancos vs. La Blagrana according to Goal.com, that corresponding fixture last year attracted a worldwide audience of 400 million. Among the queer and wonderful classico related things floating around on Friday was a tweet carrying a photo from a supermarket in Qatar. The photo revealed a stack of nut containers, nothing overly special, but it was the football kits the nuts were a morning which was of interest. Half of them were dressed in Barcelona colors, the other half in Madrid white. In Qatar, 